Welcome, one and all, to our presentation. Before we start, I just want to thank the citizens of Port Phoenix for welcoming us to their community and for the enormous amount of work involved in the creation of this wonderful facility. We really do appreciate it. The New Britannia Theatre Troupe has two items for your enjoyment today. The first is a short play written by Wombi of the Round Table. It is produced and directed by Asclepius and music is by Smart Sound. Cast of characters Lady Adnor as Lady Pansicle, Lord Baldrith as Mage Wisdom, Wombi as Lord Pansicle. We present The Helpful Mage. Thank you for coming at such short notice, Mage Wisdom. I'm at my wit's end. You say he hasn't talked to you? Have you noticed any other unusual behavior? Mostly he just sits in the corner there, except when he's hungry. I see. When did these symptoms start? It's his birthday. It happened this morning right after he opened his presents. Little does Lady Pansicle know that I am the cause of her husband's predicament. One of those presents was an enchanted ring crafted by the most brilliant mage in all the land, myself. Now the way is clear for me to pursue her ladyship. Sadly, there is no hope. Your husband is the victim of a strange enchantment, one that I have never seen before. I'm afraid nothing can be done for him. I recommend confining him to the cellar, where he will not attract undue attention. My poor darling, at least he doesn't appear to be suffering. Thank you for taking the time to help. Is there anything I can offer you to show my appreciation? No, your ladyship. It was an honor and a pleasure to have been of assistance. If you should need my help in these trying times, please do not hesitate to ask. It would give me no greater joy than to do whatever I can to ease your suffering. You are a true gentleman. At least allow me to offer you a drink after your long journey here. Thank goodness that's over. Are you all right, my dear? It was very brave of you to volunteer for this. Darling, watching you run around like a chicken this morning when that you put that ring on was most amusing. The opportunity to have a little fun was irresistible. Yes, it's a good thing you were standing there and saw what happened. 
If you hadn't taken off that ring, I'd still be pecking at seeds. It seemed odd when I unwrapped the present that there was no note enclosed. I should have been more cautious. Good thing I glanced out the window this morning and saw him leave the gift on our doorstep. So, what shall we do with him? My first thought was to hand him over to the local guards, but now I have a better idea. The obsidians are performing experience in arcane magic and are looking for people on whom they can try out interesting spells. I'm sure the mage would look quite fetching with horns and hooves. <laughs> <laughs>